Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Prison Architect where we've got a little problem. In the previous episode we were getting some more prisoners, building and finishing off this cell block here and overall we progressed on quite nicely and got that done and then we had some prisoners arrive. I want to say some prisoners, we are <laughs> on 154 prisoners out of a maximum of 112 so basically we've overdone it a little bit. This wasn't um, our choice, it was the intake set as per usual but because of the amount of building materials the game has basically double or triple spawned the intake so that's a bit of a problem how are we going to fix that well i think as a lot of people suggested to probably go over here over to our reclaimed wood walls put in this wall here and i'm going to basically build this which was originally a gym this is now going to become our holding cell for now so let's place this is there a middle uh uh, is this actually in the middle? I assume a 7 to there and then a oh, 7 to there. So let's just work up sort of 7 to there and then the door should go in, which will be correct. There we go. Okay, so that's, that's it. Uh, as I said, this is going to be the holding cell. So let's just place that in there, unpause it, remove all of that, uh, focus on the planning, and then we need to run in some pipe work, pipe work which will go to the toilets as well as a um i think we def well i think we also need a radiator or two in there so we'll see how we go as you can see all of these guys are just saying yeah we don't have anywhere to go on that well, is correct. So I could make this a dormitory, but I think that even with the size of this being a... Even with this size, I don't think it will be large enough. So anyway, we'll see how we get on. In terms of farming, we're actually doing quite well. And oh dear, the warden's now calling. Just as you've word, the prisoners are unhappy with how much time they have to work. Brilliant. Okay, so that means reducing our work time, which doesn't help us either. So regime, free time, and then reducing this to basically two hours. And that is it. Pretty much job done. Let's have a quick look. Uh, yep, that is now correct. Okay. In terms of farming, we are doing okay. We need to harvest 500 ripened crops of any type. We're on 39%. We have to produce 10 compost fertilizer, which if we look at the compost bin, you can see that they are getting there. They are slowly being deposited. So it's not as if we're not doing that, but it's just taking a little bit of time. I guess what I could do is probably dump a lot of these and then that would produce a lot of compost, but yeah, we'll see how we get on. There's some changes to be made in the pantry and in a couple of the other rooms, but I'll get to that once the crises has been averted. And obviously we need to build this yard we need to go for more planting down here and yes we are still not producing any tomatoes but we'll probably when we build this area which is was going to be sooner rather than later actually most likely we'll plant tomatoes but anyway as i said i'm just sort of letting the workers crack on here to put in all of the power cables put in uh, the different uh, things in here. Let's go ahead to rooms and have this as a holding cell. So we'll designate all of that as one holding cell there. We have, what's that? 50 potatoes? Was that that? I don't know. Anyway, and we will set up the, set up this room. So we need a toilet, benches, uh, and that's technically it, but I'm not going to just put that in. Instead, what I'll do is go over to our objects and to the bunk beds. And I'm going to put bunk beds along here. Now, you might think, well, actually, why do we need bunk beds? Well, the problem is that basically if we just have the usual stuff, just the benches, it's just not going to fill the needs of the prisoners. So let's just have in everything like so. Actually, no, let's remove that bit because I want to put them in like that for reasons that may become clear shortly so it is oh hang on we've got a bit of a fight going on here where is the fight it is in there oh yeah okay they are jumping up and down there um also i should probably check out flooring and then put the wooden floor back in a couple of these rooms because we've had some people try to escape i know that was one of the comments as well and it's mainly just in where the tunnel's been found but we'll set that going uh, over here then we need to have our well be a radiator so I'll put a radiator in the corners one two and then we also need some toilets like so if I can actually type it properly and then one two three four five six and hopefully that will suffice naturally we'll have to connect those up but I'll wait until the workers go ahead and do the other stuff although why have they not why have those utilities not been done What's going on there? I might have right clicked while I was doing something, but either way, let's hope they can crack on with that one. But because that is now a holding cell, 
I'm hoping that they will be taken to said cell, although we'll have to have a look. Um, I want to also check out our, where is it, intelligence informants, and we've got a couple of people. Uh, let's have a quick look. No, no. Apparently, uh, there's a couple of people we need to search, but we don't have one of those traits in here. There's extremely strong green thumb and a foodie, and a couple of other. We've got lots of lots of traits along the board. You can see loads and loads of traits, but we're just not aware of what they are. We don't have anyone that is, well, anyone that's a snitch or an informant or whatever you would like to call it. Either way, the workers are cracking on with whatever they're supposed to be doing. Looks like, yeah, they're coming to put in things in this holding cell. I'll force open that solitary door for them. Uh, there are high levels of contraband in here, apparently. Uh, that is... That is, I guess, true. And we have a lot of people that are waiting <laughs> solitary confinement there. We do need to build our other solitary confinement area probably sooner rather than later. But the main one is getting this holding cell, which, as you can see, is now is now legitimate. So all of these prisoners will be moved to the holding cell. I am really hoping that our programs and parole hearing is going to pay off. I can't start any more, so we'll have to see. Luckily, I think they do that on free time. It does not say, but they are scheduled by the look of it. Either way, it's going to uh, work, <laughs> we hope. Over to our pipe work then with hot water piping, and I'm going to connect up the hot water pipes. How we're going to do this? Hot water pipes will run pretty much just up and then to that, like so, and then the standard small pipe work. I'll just run in and to them once I've got all the toilets. So there's that toilet and there's that set of toilets as well. So there's our holding cell. So at least they have benches, at least they have toilets, and they'll also have some bunk beds. I'm not going to put anything else in there. There's no reason to put anything that will... Ah, that's the search underwear. That's the every five days, I believe. <laughs> We've got a problem with food trace as well. <laughs> Anyway, we have got the holding cell in, so all of these prisoners should be escorted eventually to that. Yep, yeah, you can see they are being escorted over to there. So the guards coming along, getting them and taking them over. Today's beverage is green tea, by the way. So that is all right. Obviously, they still have to... Well, they're still in the facility, so they still have access to things like... Oh, look at that. That guy's doing, what's that? Alcoholic scoop therapy? Yeah, we've got alcoholic scoop therapy with a good attendance there. We've got 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I don't know if he's attending it. Yeah, reform program. So we've got 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 people doing that. Okay, that's all right. And people coming through here. I know there's been <laughs> a lot of comment regarding Tim Newell. And it's sort of split in the middle. People saying... Oh, he's, he's quite iconic. We should keep him in the facility and do what we can and blah, blah, blah. And other people suggesting various means and methods to make this guy no longer alive. So, yeah, I'm, I'm not really up for that. If throughout the course of the game that he, he kicks off and gets on the wrong side of someone and whatever, then... Now, that's natural causes, isn't it? Natural causes. Uh, whereas, you know, us doing something malicious, no, not, not so much, not so much. We still have people in here, and and now we've got the chief calling. One of the spiritual leaders bringing our religious programs has been rallying amidst with all kinds of hateful speech. They've been fired, but the prisoners will take some time to cool down. Okay. Fair enough. In terms of harvest, we've harvested apples and potatoes. We are working on carrots and cabbages. We don't have... Oh, do we have peaches? We do have peaches. And we do have the other stuff as well. Fine. Speaking of items, let's go over to objects and scroll right into the pantry. Then scroll down and we've got some storage shelves. One, two, three, followed by some of the, hang on, where is it, tall fridges, which are going to go right down the bottom, job done. They do require power, but naturally they have got power because of where I've placed it, so that is good. In terms of funds, we have actually very good funds, as you might imagine, having the amount of prisoners uh, that we have, although these guys, are they, are they being escorted? No, they are not being escorted anywhere. No, no, they are being escorted. There you go, it's just taking them quite some time. I'm going to 
hire a couple more staff members. Let's see if they do anything. It's taking them some time. But, uh, oh, 24 available. Okay, we didn't need them at all. There is someone that's overdosing, and obviously they'll be taking them over to the infirmary. Sadly, it's at the opposite end of the... It's at the opposite end of this place, so it will take quite some time to get there. We are making compost. It is working. Hmm, we'll just have to see. And luckily, you can see prisoner uniforms have actually been delivered to the holding cell. We are how many over? We're on 112 maximum. But we've got 150 prisoners. And what's happening here? There's prisoner Hass. Tenthrus the Tooth Hass. Prisoner number 10621270. They are apparently been kicking off. Punishment is low. Has got 13 penalties. 133% of state and reform programs. Hmm. No reputation. So I don't know why they've been kicking off. Oh, hateful speech. Yeah. Um, I didn't... Where's that prisoner? I don't think I'll be able to find them again. There they are. So if I check on them, we can see that their experience is with spiritual guidance. So... The people that have been riled up by the preacher. That's what we can expect. Just random outbursts. So, yeah. We are probably okay for building a bit more. How is over here doing? Oh, there we go. So, we've got this all put in now. So, we've got the shelves in the pantry, which allows them to store more. And I believe these also allow them to store something. So, that's good. We've uh, got good storage there. I will do a shakedown sooner rather than later. Look, good grief. It's still... We're still waiting for those guys to be moved over. I don't think it's going to happen. I really don't think it is. Uh, one of our options then, let's have a quick look at our programs. Uh, yes, we know I've got some of these that are all broke. I'll have to sort these out later. I think it would be... 40 in the queue, yeah. Let's do another guard taser certification. I think it would be good to build... I don't think we need another... Don't think we need another cell in here. Look at that. All the guards are bringing food in here. But they're all empty. That's very strange. Very strange indeed. Okay, I thought people were being brought over to the holding cell, but it does not seem to be working that way. Yeah, people have been brought in. And obviously we have got reform. I'm going to do a full shakedown. So, shakedown all sectors. 555 places to search. We'll check informants while we're on. There's a supplier and a foodie. We've got all manner of traits. Ah, I wonder if the people in this solitary are the ones that were waiting there. No. No, they haven't got any punishments. And is that a tunnel? That is a tunnel. It went quite far as well. The tunnels went from their cell out and then one two three four and a bit lengths cell lengths up so yeah good for them i guess we'll just quickly remove all that and i'm going to i think focus on putting in the solitary quite frankly and there we are over to our doors and i normally well i've, I've used solitary doors so i'm going to stick with that approach but I do like the other doors, which are the secure doors. They've got like a little hatch where you can pass food through. I don't know if mechanically it makes any difference. I really don't. But, whoa. See that? See the lights flash on and on and off there. Wow. We actually ran out of power for the first time ever, I think. We've got... It's spring and overcast, so we're getting negative on solar and not much on the wind. It's slowly going up now, but we did have an issue there. All right, all right. Anyway, this is getting built. We will go over to our flooring, and I believe it is the reclaimed rubber flooring is what we've went with. So once we've got that, I'll place that in there. Reclaimed brick there. Just double checking that those should be reclaimed brick, yeah. And then just the rooms. So solitary. Clicky, clicky, draggy, draggy. 
and there's some more solitary rooms done. This is really cold, and that is, after all, the cooler, so that's just the nature of the beast. I'm just going to double check to make sure that, yeah, we have people assigned prison labour to pretty much everywhere, but obviously we're only working a very short amount of time per day. So, yeah. And we're still waiting for these some of these guys to be escorted. All right. I was going to really focus very quickly on perhaps building another cell block, but I'm really not too sure. There's some early prisoner releases. We are almost on harvest 500 ripened crops of any type. There we go. We've just got that. So it's just produced fertilizer that we have to do. Um, it's carrots and cabbages and tomatoes. And I think that's about it. Yeah. What I'm very tempted to do, as I've said, is is go to... Is there a dump? Dismantle. Hmm. See, I can dump these. And I'm sure if I dump, like, the corn and cabbage, I think when they do that, it's then put into these recycling bags and then be brought into here. Yeah, yeah. Fine. The question is whether or not that needs to be redone or not. I don't know. There's all the people trying to steal oranges. You notice that some people are ignoring this one-way thing, but most of them are going that way, and they've all been found. <laughs> they've all been found with stuff on them. Hang on a second. Let's have a quick look at this. Um, intelligence, last 24 hours. <laughs> yeah, I think we've got a problem with orange contraband. I don't know what else I can do about it. I mean, we've got the checkpoints. The checkpoints are there to stop them. That's the whole point. We've also got people here which are uh, having oranges sort of snuck in as well. I was going to put some dogs around this area and that would smell anything stinky out. But there's no point. We've got the checkpoints. You know, the majority of people, well, they are being searched. So it seems to just be working there. Anyway, danger level is increasing. We will check our prisoners' needs. We can see that there is a high need for a lot of things, and that's because, well, a lot of these guys don't have full access to it. They don't have access to a shower, that's for sure. I should probably put in a shower in here now that I think about it. Let's go ahead and go to objects. going to go for a shower pillar, which I'll put in there and put in there. I will then put shower head. That's a bin. Although I guess if you empty the bin you could probably have a shower in it I wouldn't want to try it but you know needs must sometimes and there's all of our showers in and then we'll connect all those up and at least we have some showers for for those people so there you are food I think we're doing okay let's have a quick look and need food yep food there's a little bit of critical need but nothing major so overall that seems to be functioning and it looks like that's working fine compost bin is the slowly going up so we will eventually get that one done that's the advanced farming there so we shall see and looks like we just need to plumb in these things here so once again water and water and then job done okay and then there's enclosed surrounds by walls and doors why are they not oh apparently the door there hadn't been placed uh, sorry, the bit of wall there. It's probably just a misclick on my part. Prioritise that. And... <laughs> I think what's happened... And... I could be wrong about this. We have, obviously, a lot more prisoners... In here than we should. But... So many have been found... Nicking stuff. And got caught through this contraband checkpoint here. That they've been put into these two solitaries. And as such, the people that were in reception have now been escorted to their old cells. <laughs> Let's do a full tunnel search. We'll see how we get on there. And then I need to think about really going for some more farming. That's really what I wanted to, to look at. So... Let's have a fence gate, standard fence gate there, and then checkpoint. 
which is one and then two, like that. And then it's flooring. I'll put the flooring in. Oh, that's iron flooring. Reclaim brick. It's going to go around here. And then in. And how have I got it set up? It's almost certainly going to be a bit of a mismatch across the board. Uh, it's down there, isn't it? Because this becomes a pantry. Yep, that's right. And then it's basically along, up, across, across. And is it double around? It is double around, so it's uh, that. So that's the basic footprint. I do need to put in the in-between bits, but I'll measure the other bits first. We'll also go to walls and to the grass fence. Put that in there. What sort of one we got there? We got the standard gates. That is standard gates. Those are south. These ones want to be actually there as well. Actually, they're slightly different, isn't it? Whatever, they'll go there. That should be fine. And... Is that it? What flooring have we got in these ones? We got that flooring in. So I'll put the flooring in there. And we'll obviously get some continuity across the board. And the priority, we'll have to set that as well. So that's in deployment. And then prisoner direction, it's that, basically. Did I do? Yep, that's fine. And then the other prisoner direction is automatically set. Just going to double check our staff only areas. Oh, I've got that set of staff only. That's why nobody's going there. <sighs> There's a little mistake there, wasn't there? Did you spot it? <laughs> That'll probably function now. I would have thought it would give me an alert because that was staff only, but apparently not. Hopefully things are well. To be fair, things have been working up until now anyway. There we go. People are being escorted to it. Brilliant. Okay. My mistake. These things happen. Could load the previous save. Stop the record and start again. You would have never known. Let's leave it in. Warts and all. Right. We do need to put in these corn plants again because I cancelled some stuff off by the look of it. Uh, the ones down here, by the way, I think these are going to be 100% tomatoes. Foundations more and then to the reclaimed wood wall, which I'm going to Mm, have to be very careful. Let's build it like that. And that is that is the right size for the pantry. The pantry will then have an entrance. So that is walls and doors. Doors. Normal door. Place that there. Unpause it. Let them crack on. We also want to put in some more flooring. Which will go across like so. And there we are. So this one we'll have to... There you go, look, as soon as they start to leave, all of these oranges, because they're trying to make booze. I mean, we haven't really looked at this for a while. Oh, hang on. Let's have a look here. Recruit informant. Recruit informant. Recent misconduct for Benjamin Lovegrove. Attacked staff, found weapons, found tools, found drugs, produced narcotics, and found luxuries. So they probably had the... Was it the bag? Yeah, the booze bag. Because we'll still find all these oranges, and when they bring it in, they'll still have that. I don't know what the solution is to fix that. I really don't. Over to walls and doors, and then to our walls. Reclaim wood wall is obviously going to replace all of this, which will then most likely mess up all of the staff only sections and that will go horrible and I'll have to redo it, whatever. Anyway, I should also probably check out our programs. I'm going to stop the guard taser certification and we can see that six hours left for prisoners demand less work. Once that's done, we should be alright. Pantry, we will connect up like so. We'll also make sure that we have the objects in this time from day one. So it is one, two, three, followed by the storage. Uh, sorry, the fridge is on the top. And then obviously we need some electrical cable, which we have run. Did we just run straight down? We did run straight down like so. And that should be that pretty much completed. You can see a lot of prisoners are going to this yard, and they're running around that. Uh, do we have a running track? No. 
Perfect for our inmates to jog on. Walk speed very fast. Improves the, uh, the uh, grade of the yard. I could have a running track on the periphery around here. Walk speed very fast and improves the yard. Uh, yeah, improves the grading of it. But I don't think we need to improve the grading because we haven't got that turned on. Anyway, Warden. Prisoners settle down about the amount of time they have to work. Excellent. I will go over to our regime, to the work slash free time, and then put it back to normal. And because of that, I can now also check out the programs and reschedule all programs. And finally, we get that going. And there we are. That is hopefully all right. Just going down. Yeah, that is pretty much okay. We have a lot of people interested in flower therapy. So I may check that out in but a moment. Let's see. Let's go to planning and to... Well, it's not really matter, but in this case, walls. And I can see that the... Why are they going this way? Ah, oh, they're all coming to Nick Oranges. <laughs> Uh, well, I don't know why my laugh sounded a bit like muckly for a second there, but what, what, what? They're taking fresh fruit. They're taking fresh oranges. They're just going to be found out. Look at that! They're bringing, they're bringing their trays in. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> don't really know what else to say other than all right. You, you, you're going to be found out. Um. I might have to change policy for a moment. Anyway, over to flooring. Reclaim brick, followed by ceramic. Just to get that done. And double check our planning. It is 10 across. So, 10. So we'll do that. 10. 10. Then that. Alright, fine. Now not. And... Flooring, reclaim brick, straight down, straight down, and straight down, and then in there is where we'll have our have our fields. So we'll remove that. We had another dingaling there. We still need to produce more fertilizer. It is it is going up. You can see it is slowly, very very slowly going up, but it's taking its time. It is taking its time. We now have people... Oh, Featherstone! And a death. What? Overdosed? In, in the infirmary? May I inquire as to where our staff members are? Ah, healing over there. Right, fine. I guess, to be fair... The size of our facility, I think we do need a couple more staff members. So, yeah. I'm going to dump these food trays. I'm going to have to do it manually. I'm also going like, to dump these boxes of oranges and stuff just to get some recycled bits. Same as the apples, just dump them. So I'm just trying to get some... F oh, it just makes it... turns it into garbage, it doesn't turn it into... Anything you can recycle. It's a bit of a shame. But at least the holding cell is now working. Good. Looks like Tim Newell's got another 53 hours in solitary. <laughs> I know a lot of people suggested we have him permanently locked in there. Well, what do you think he is? <laughs> like, I don't have permanent punishments. No, I don't even have legal, actually. Should probably research that. Yeah, so... I think I'm gonna have to get rid of a couple of a couple of staff members. One, two. I'm firing anyone that hasn't got a taser. Three and four. There we go. Just try and get a bit more cash. But yeah, we don't have permanent punishments, but we don't need it. He's always up to no good. There's all all kind of nonsense going on, and he just just kicks off. Alright, so what have we got? We have this as a... 
Is this a vegetable field? Vegetable farming and fruit orchard, I think, is what we've got. So it's vegetable, farming, fruit orchard, like so. And we need to place the objects as per. So it is a shed. I'm basically going to mirror it from the other side. So this is, that's normally down, it's basically as close to the top as we can get it. And then the compost bins. I'm going to put them in actually all of these because we will be getting there anyway. And there we are. There's those sheds in. I know there's been a lot of requests to do automation. We currently haven't got any automation and we haven't got drain pipes, uh, drip pipes. We haven't got auto harvesters or anything like that. I am up for doing that. It's just going to depend on as and when, really. At the moment, I'm putting in what I know, which is just place these in. And then we'll look at doing the automation stuff later on. There's lots of early releases, so that's uh, pretty good. We have now, as you can see there, a decent amount of stuff done in the field, so we can place that. And I think we can go for vegetables. So for vegetables, we've got all manner of stuff. We're going to go with tomatoes. Oh, that's right. Flooring into grass. So one, two three there we go we have still only 40 percent of prisoners passing the foundation education course so it's not ideal but yeah going back to the automation i'm 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 very i'm wanting to do the automation but it's that's like a lot more advanced than at the moment comfortable with it should be it shouldn't be too much of a problem i guess because just you know you need an auto gatherer right got you and then you need an auto harvester activates every six hours harvesting all crops in the area 10 tiles wide will be locked by walls and doors or blocked by walls and doors so realistically we could build a like field around here that's just several of these and then we have auto gatherers there's your basic one and then auto scythe. What's that done? Oh, that's a five by five. So, yeah, you've got the auto gather, which is a five by five gathering. A scythe, which is the sim similar thing, but it's just for um, harvesting. But then you've got the bigger ones, which cost more, but obviously are a bit larger. So yeah, we could do that. It should be quite. It should be quite an easy thing to do, actually. Now that look at, although we haven't got any drip pipes, we'd have to have sprinklers as well. Yeah. And run those across. We shall see. We'll have a play around. I'm going to build probably this area here is going to be a flower therapy area. And then down the bottom we'll probably try automation. And then once we've got that down obviously we can figure things out. We still need to sort of move a lot of these wind turbines. And set up a set up a workshop in there. So there's there's lots of stuff to do. I should also check out our temperature which is... As far as I can tell, fine across the board. Pantry's not very warm. Not that we really need it warm. So, this is now being turfed. So, objects scrolling down. And I want to have... I do like tomatoes. Let's go with... A 10 by 10 tomato harvest. And then I think we're going to go with... Carrots for the rest of them. Like that. For the farming, what have we got? We've got a lot of things, actually. But I'm not too sure. I mean, do we just... How have we got when it comes to our selling? Hang on. It is ingredients. You see, ingredients, we got a lot of them ingredients just getting sold. Uh, sorry, our ratio is like 25%. I'm going to reduce it down even further. We just want to use... Uh, even further. We just want to use as much of our stuff inside the prison as we can. But I will have to check out crop distribution. So I'll set up this. Like that. And then we want this going there. Is that not working? One, two, 
three. That one goes... Oh, that one goes to the canteen. That's right. Okay, so that's okay. And it looks like... Oh, it's just set up automatically. Each field. 50% exports. I mean, how much do we have? Let's do a full shakedown. We've got a lot. And I think with these fields, I think we can export even more. I really do. For the farming field then, let's go with... Barley. And then... Corn. Like that. I think also... A couple more farmers. Proper job. Are needed. And we need bananas as well. Do we not have banana trees? Orange, peach, banana, apple. Yeah, we do. So why would not. Oh, sell. Right, sell. Fine, we will do that. So, objects, banana trees. Banana. Safety word is banana. And we'll have one, two, insufficient funds. Cool. Costs a little bit more to plant those, so I'll wait for them to crack on. And once again, people are being found out as they go through this. What I'm going to do is go over to our policy and go down. When they are found with... Uh, ooh. That's the thing. What are, what are oranges classed as? It's an orange, right? It doesn't say... I mean, look at the state of that. There's all... They're, oh, their class is produced drugs. I think. That just says orange. Alright. What I'll do is... For our low-risk prisoners, which is all of them... If you're found with luxuries, you're going to get two hours. Solitary. Do I want solitary? No. I want lockdown. Narcotics. Four hours. Lockdown. Found drugs. Uh, actually, no. We will do solitary. We'll open this a little bit. Because, quite frankly, they're not, uh, they're not getting the, <laughs> they're not getting the message. There we go. So, so far, on this shakedown, we've found one club, one shank, two knives, a needle, a bottle of medicine, Pair of scissors, cell phone, five lighters, set of shears, pair of, a sedative syringe, two kickers, which I'm not too sure what they are. Are they like laced oranges or something? A booze bag, three produced drugs, and 54 oranges. <laughs> right, fine, I guess. We have our solar been very good actually that's uh, fine I'm gonna check out our grants there I just I just need the solar solar panel development I'm gonna stop this shakedown it's 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 really playing havoc with the facility and there we are we're down to 190 prisoners of 112 and then more people getting found drugs let's see what this says mm. What's it classed as? Found tools, drugs, narcotics, and luxuries. Same thing. It's all drugs and luxuries. I'm guessing that's what the oranges are all about. We shall see. But at least we're doing something about it. Balance is not great, I'll be honest. There's good exports there. 
but you can see there's prisoner uniforms being bought in as well. It's only really early releases that we're, we're getting. Oh, we're buying compost fertilizer. Right, you know what? Uh... Automatic fertilizer, none. Yeah. Because we're just spending far too much on fertilizer. And I'm thinking that with the now increased farms, we've doubled up on farms. Hopefully we'll be alright on that front. We shall see if any of that is, what I've said, is actually accurate. But there you are. Right, I think we will leave it there for now. That's been a bit of Prison Architect. A lot less stressful than I thought it was going to be. We managed to get the holding cell built and sadly kept his stuff only for a little while. But it's now all sorted. Prisoners are having their, well, most of their needs net. Um, needs net, I think I just said there. Needs met. So that's all right. Hopefully, well, it's certainly the, the ones that they need. So not things like... Oh, you know, they don't have books, things like that. It's it's not a critical need, but sort of, you know, toiletries, food, water, shelter, etc. All that's being done. We are getting close for our max capacity, so we're coming down to that, which is fine. A lot of it being early parole and release. We have got the other solitary up and running, and another pantry and area for farming so overall quite happy with as i said our progress there next episode i want to go ahead and finish off the fruit orchard because obviously it requires some cash there and then deal with whatever this is about either way we will call it there <laughs> next episode we'll see what the chief's all about thanks very much for watching take care and generic partings